Oh, um, the approach shoes? Mm -hmm. I probably should, really a pair of approach shoes is probably ideal for this hike. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. Wow, <laughs> it does show up. It's a trim. What are they doing? I don't know. Wow, <laughs> so cool. And sun's starting to come up now. Beautiful. Wow, see last year there was like a waterfall coming off of that. Really? Yeah, it's all dry. That's so crazy. Yeah, if you see my video from last year, it was like in August, it was just rushing down. Now we're approaching the e wedges. Once we scramble up this a little bit, I found the infamous bivy point at the ledges. <laughs> at the e ledges. Yeah, that was a memory. <laughs> uh, wow. Yeah, we just basically made it over. The E wedges, like, there's just a little bit more to go. <laughs> See, like, when you're up here, and you look <laughs> down with the camera, it looks so much worse. <sighs> and that's it, actually. Now we're done. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now the trail kind of follows this a ways up, and then once we get up there, uh, we'll be at Lower Boy Scout. Cool. Yeah.
Oh yeah, I mean, I just, I just stick with deep because I know it works. Yeah. That natural stuff doesn't work as it does, well. Oh, it, it really doesn't at all. That's how I feel. Come on. Mm -hmm. It's a buck. <laughs> so people ask me, do you think I should filter my water? Now this is why you should probably filter your water. This is a wag bag. This is what you crap in when you're in the Whitney zone. And people just leave them instead of taking them out. These are the same people that walk their dog and when they take a shit, they bag it in a little piece of plastic and then leave the shit with it in the bag right on the sidewalk. Same fucking people. Don't do this. Fuck. <laughs> this is why we filter our water. Because <laughs> there's holes in it. There's fucking holes in it. So then when the snow, once this gets covered in snow and then it melts, all that fun stuff inside ends up in your water. <laughs> it, have to have our safety meeting. It's so great. We're at four hours and 20 minutes into our trip, so... Well, there's Whitney. You can see the Mountaineers route, the chute. Snow still up in it. Anyone going up the Mountaineers route, that's what you're looking at. And then today's, what is today, the 12th? Or 13th, something like that. Yeah. Of, uh, of June. Yeah. <laughs> 
Isn't that just stunning? Oh my God. That's so cool, Summit of Russell. We did it. Like, I guess if I sit on this rock, that's technically the highest point, or maybe that rock over there. I don't think it matters too much. Fucking a. <laughs> yeah, you could see the traverse over there, like foot boot prints. Yeah, right there. Whoa, am I tripping out? Okay, it's gotta be a rock. Kind of looked like the shape of a guy. <laughs> Dang. That's wild. Yeah, so behind us is that, that's that false summit. That's the east summit. And we're on the... Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> yeah, it's just incredible. I think that's Tyndall right yeah. there. I think that's Tyndall. And I think Williamson, uh, I don't think that, is that Williamson or is that Williamson? I'll have to look on, on the map. Whew. Time for a much deserved snack and I'm gonna dig through the registry. Dang, I wanna drop my phone in for a second. That's so scary. <laughs> I don't wanna look over. <laughs> Any treasure? A safety pin. <laughs> safety pin for a safety meeting. No, mm -hmm. <laughs> Defying Mother Nature. Hmm. I feel like that's not what we want to do. No, I respect Mother Nature. Won't really and even when we were coming up here, I was like, I was like, mountain gods. <laughs> June 22nd, 2017. Beating the Owens Valley heat. It's not 105 up here. That's for sure. <laughs> Wait, what? I think this is the newest one over here, right? right on. One hour from car via Tyrolean Traverse. I don't know, I don't know what the hell they're talking about. <sighs> How do you do a Tyrolean Traverse? They're fucking riding the lightning or something. <laughs> 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 I don't know. I don't know what. What they're... the hell? Why is it like mad? Dang! Like, I'm trying to find the last signature. Oh, I think I'm coming up on it here. Dude, I'm hot. Or I'm not even hot. Like, I'm body temperature wise, I'm like perfectly comfortable. Dude, I think this is it. Six, six, twelve. Oh, uh, that's funny. It says six, twelve, twenty-four. Maybe the best scramble I've ever done. So much fun. What an absolute gift it is to be up here. Aww. Peter Schneider, Seattle, Washington. That's today. Is the tw today the 12th? I think, yeah. Today is the 12th. Wow. Oh, yeah. I think you're right. Because I work on the 14th, and that's not tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah, same. Oh, 
So these are the two that came up here today. Yeah. So someone came up yesterday too. Fuck yeah. I can't. I, it's in a different language. I don't know what the one yesterday, but six, twelve, twenty-four, all by myself. Cameron Stone Adams, Sacramento, California. So funny how many there's so many little bugs up here. Mm -hmm. I wonder how many people have come up here so far this year. It's probably not too many, because that was, what, three, four, five, six, six, oh, wait, no, seven, seven. So, yeah. When is the earliest one? This year, 427. Nice. Thank thankfully, the winds died down. It was a beautiful day. Matt Yamamoto, Auburn, California, I guess. The sun is so bright. Up fish hook, brr. The first pitch was cold as a deranged steep uncle wore glove liners for like 95% of the route. <laughs> I ate a sour gummy worm. I found it here at the top. <laughs> How old oh was it? <laughs> How old was it? Summit is gorgeous. Lots of love. Damien Nicoderm, I think. Nicoderm. If I Nicoderm, I don't know. Oh, I turned four. Uh, I turned forty in two days, in the midst of a deep heartbreak and a mild life crisis. Mm. Up here with a good homie for my first alpine climb ever. Mm. Up Fishhookerette. Thank God for the mountains and new beginnings. Justin Riley. Yeah, that's crazy. Solo East Arette from, I don't know where you'd be. Oh, Upper Boy Scout. Beauty of a Scramble. Yeah, that's crazy. Really not too many people. Seven people. Now nine. Hell yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Well, go ahead. Sign it. We found the sign. <laughs> Mount Russell. 1446. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it was just flipped over. Yeah. That's what was funny. I was like, I was like, how does this little rock get up here? And then it flipped over and it was like, oh. That's how. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How does that little rock get up here? It's probably got, I wonder if it's painted too. So Are people carrying fucking rocks I'm up saying, here? Like, how did they get up here? <laughs> no, nah, there's nothing written on there. So I don't know. How did that little rock get up here? I know. <laughs> There's nothing for it to break off of. Yeah. Well, one of life's mysteries, I guess. <laughs> All right, time to descend. Oh, yeah, I found gloves. A pair of REI gloves. Yeah, I'm talking to myself and the camera, to the imaginary people that might be listening. They're all just the voices in my head. Just about to the bottom of this, and then we'll get back on the Mountaineers route. Ooh. And lower Boy Scout. Ooh.
<sighs> Long day, but we're almost finished. There's like so many moths. I don't know how well they'll come up on camera. Back on the Whitney Trail. Oh yes. Alright. Oh yeah, it's so colorful. Oh wow, even behind us, the cloud. Oh, bright. What'd you find? Dude, that's sick. There you go. You, oh, you got a C knock. There you go. That's you could sick. fit your um you could fit your uh, bee free on there. Oh my god. That's like the coolest piece of like trail gear I've ever seen. See, found. the trail provides. Wow. Always finding stuff. <laughs>